Alright, so we're going to start with the butter bun. And look at this. Look at the amount of butter here. Whoa. I mean, obviously very creamy. I love the bun. Oh, it's so hot. It's so hot. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Holy. Real butter cheese. Look at the amount Look at the amount of cheese. That's ridiculous. Wow. <laughs> I need to enjoy it. Yeah. So this is the egg burji. Let's get like that. Oh, this is gonna be so amazing right here. Kima pao. So kima is minced mutton meat. Mutton is basically Go. Uh, goat. The goat, mutton, meat is the best in India. One be the hot chocolate version of India. That's amazing hot chocolate. The only problem is it's extremely hot outside. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. They're fighting fire with fire. Yeah. The misal pa. It's a little spicy because they put some gravy on top and they put like super spicy on the side. Mm. A little spicy. <laughs> no, it's got to go on me, man. I'm very excited right now because I've never tried my sapphuri. Like you said, it's like a ping pong ball. Mm. And this is all a one gulper. It feels like a lot of snacks, not spicy at all. It makes a very nice chat. Next up, we have the sponge dosa. This is a southern Indian dish. It's basically a crepe. We have some mint and coconut chutney. Oh, it's beautiful. It feels so southern, like tropical. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. All right, so here we have a dish I've never tried before. It's called Dava Palau. It just, it looks so rich in spices. It's gonna, and it's a little hot right now. I gotta give it a second in the air. Woo! Not too spicy. The rice is actually not like too super soft. A little hard, nice. Buttermilk. 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 It's like pure milk, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like, straight up. Sugarcane juice with some lemon. Mm. Amazing. Oh, so sweet, so oh. subtle. Yeah. It cools you down immediately. So yeah. refreshing. I mean, I feel it like just like. Oh, it's cooling me down instantly. So I've had a vada pa before. This time it's a little different though because they have a mint chutney here. Oh, yeah, I'm so right. excited. Get after it. Oh, hot. Oh. Hot? Oh. Oh, wow. That's a dad and <laughs> Too hot. Too hot. Kasu cut me. Mmm. Super soft texture. It's almost like a vanilla bar. Wow. But that may Yeah, but when you broke it, it sure crumbled. <laughs> oh. Dude, everything here is so sweet. Okay, Sam, so we did it. We're trying tandoori chai. Let's Cheers, bro. Cheers, let's give it a shot. Oh my gosh, that's good. That's good, but still really hot. Still a little bit too hot, yeah. Considering it's so hot outside. Oh my god, look at this tally, guys. This is so Beautiful, the mix of colors, the smell, the aroma. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, look, look at that. that. This is the best parata. And this is my favorite part about Indian food. Taking it, like I said, taking it for a swim in the sauce. But it's so good. <laughs> this one looks more like a, like a doll. Oh yeah. Very tomato looking. Mm. That's good, huh? Very earthy, tomato-y. Raita right here. That makes it sweet, but it's sour. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Get big pieces, sweet corn. Oh, it's a nice sauce, not too spicy. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this super hot red chili. So I have all the spices. Super spicy food. Oh, shit. <laughs> so the next dish we have is called upma. I'm just gonna get some of that coconut. Mm. Wow, I love this ginger chutney. Mm. Now we have one of the most traditional dishes. It's called bongo. Try some of the peanut. 
Put some ginger chutney. Mmm. Oh, and that spice is amazing. Oh, this is the biggest foodie I've ever seen. It's basically a puffed up flatbread. Super thick. Mmm. Oh, that curry's delicious. Mmm. Okay, so next up is utapam. Some of the coconut. Mmm. Oh wow. Mmm, you can really taste the textures of all the vegetables. For me, ginger isn't that bad, but this one is extreme. Mmm. Okay, so here we have the pizza dosa. Just gonna bathe it. Oh my gosh, that looks so good, dude. Mmm. This is so freaking good. Okay, so right here we have the Szechuan cream dosa. We also have coconut chutney at the very end. A little sweeter in taste, a little spicy. Yep. Mmm, man. The first one was amazing. This one's even better. The third one we have here is palak paneer, which basically is spinach with cottage cheese. I'm about to have a dose of orgasm. Oh. Okay, so the next thing we're trying is an idli. So this is actually the tawa idli. Paneer is it also has cream. Oh yeah, I love the flavors. Mmm. Okay, so here we have the traditional version of an idli. I really enjoy idli. It, there's not like a crazy amount of flavors with idli, but it's nice, it's heavy. Oh. Go with the With the chutney, it's amazing. Here we go, the first thing we're trying is a tandoori fish. It's a marrow fish. Okay, here we go. Oh wow. It's funny because it yeah, actually has a texture of like butter. This is banglakuri. Mm. Pretty good. So this is a river pond with masala. All right, here we go. Mm. Oh yeah, it's amazing. Our next dish is one of the most exotic dishes I've ever seen. Basically, it's bamboo chicken. Mm. It's crazy. It has a taste of bamboo. Straight up. Feels really? like I'm eating a plant mixed with chicken. This is so amazing. Here we have Kodi Bepuru. Here we go. Mmm. A little spicy, not too spicy. They provided us with rose milk. Rose milk. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> that looks erotic. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so the next dish we have is bandu meret kapai. Mmm, like orange chicken, like Chinese orange chicken. Oh wow! Mmm, it's fantastic. Wow! Oh, you're giving you me the egg. Yeah, oh, <laughs> you get God. the egg, bro. The egg. <laughs> you better eat it all. So chicken, vegetables. This actually looks like a risotto. The way it's like very moist. Oh my God. This is so unique. I've never had a palau actually. I thought it was all about biryanis, but palau is another type of not of a rice dish. Matka mutton palau. That's the butteriest lamb I ever had. Okay, so our last dish here is kuki waya palau. Mm. Oh, let's go to town with this. Cheers. Still to the top. And these were 10 rupees each. Very it's like refreshing. A, a lime soda drink. These peanuts. Basically, what he does is he roasts peanuts. Yeah. They're just very natural. It's not. And then here, oh my god, look at that. Mmm. It was super nice, roasty. A little hot. Yeah. No salt. Perfect little snack, man. Yeah, man. Get me through the next few hours till we get eat that some, biryani. Get a little. Uh, right here we have papti. This is actually papti chat. Yeah. And this is samosa chat. So the difference here is this one has samosa, which is like an empanada yeah. on the bottom, broken up. Mm. It's sweet. It's sour. It's crunchy. Oh, it's a little spicy. I love how they have chickpeas throughout. Papti chat. Oh, yeah. Love the crunch here. It's been a while since I've had kulfi. Here we go. This one's really nutty, I gotta mm, say, dude. It's super nutty. Mmm. Pistachios. Wow, the almonds. Yeah. It's very creamy. I love how nutty it is. Yeah. It's really nutty. 
Here we go, we're gonna try 25 varieties. All right, so this one is coconut with cherry. Super rich with sugar. Mmm, big chunks of strategy coconut. Yeah. Oh my god. Good stuff. I love it. You love coconut? You're gonna love this. I love too, coconut. Man. Okay, so here we have it chocolate with cashews. Mmm. Oh wow. So this is a sugar cookie with cream inside. <laughs> that cream is like icing. Oh, and wow. it like melted through with the chai. Oh, dude. We have parata, we have ginger chicken, and we have. Chicken 65 boneless, right here. These just pop. Oh, I love the curry in it. Have a song. Trying the ginger chicken, look at this. Mm. It actually has like an orange sauce. Ooh, it's spicy. Oh, wow. Mm. Get in, get in there. Okay, now we're gonna have some Indian drinks, which are sort of like desserts. Right here we have lassi, and here we have faluda. Mmm. Oh, cherries throughout. Most delicious. Cherry syrup. Oh man, that's awesome. Look at that right there. Whoa. It's very like an Asian drink. You know, in Asia, most of the desserts yeah. are Johnson desserts. Wow, dude, that looks so good. So just letting you guys know, the classic biryani is rice yeah. with exotic masala rice in the middle. So basmati rice with exotic masala rice in the middle, and then in the bottom you have mutton. My lost for words. Oh my god. Is that good? It's that good. Like it really is probably the best biryani I've ever had in my life. Mmm. Mmm. So always one hand over here. Okay, awesome. You can either have it with any of these three curries. Mmm. Uh -huh. And I love this booty. It's actually a little thicker. It's not as thin as the one we had for breakfast today. This is awesome. Wow. I love eating like you this. You can feel it. You can feel it. Yeah, you can feel it. Oh, yeah. Mm. <laughs> That's not bad for your first bite, dude. Not bad. Oh, my God. <laughs> not bad at all. It's fantastic. I'm so excited to eat. This kulcha, 100 years, the same recipe. Right here we have the paneer, balak paneer, and this makita, makita. Beer all popping. <laughs> this is so amazing. I'm always hungry when it's about the queso de jama. <laughs> okay, so here we go. This is Amritari kulcha. I got the green chilies. Then next to we have the chickpeas, which is a chole. And this is like some onions. <laughs> yeah. Oh. What do you think? What do you say? Oh my god. Dude. You can taste the butter, it's so amazing. Oh, I can't wait. Okay, so here we have paneer burji. That was amazing the way he made it. It looks like scrambled eggs. Wow. It's like one of the creamiest, most delicious, yes. full of herbs sauce ever. It's like a sauce. It's basically a big sauce. Okay, so we saw the process. It's pretty incredible. Good. How is it? Mm, it's like a super thick milk thick. I love lassies. Every single day I was in India earlier this year, I drank one. Okay, right, here we go. Let's do this, man. Let's do this. Let's get into it. So, chapatis, right? Flat bread. Flat bread. Let's go in, get some dal with the hands. Mm. Mm. Oh. The dal's a little, a little hot, right? Mm. Spicy. Punjabi Thali. I'm sorry, Punjabi Thali. Look at this. We have, I guess, uh, dal, paneer, uh, chole, chole, raita, raita, rice, rice. This. Wow. Here we go. Oh, right there. Oh, that was like, mm. super sweet. Oh my god. This is amazing. Here we have puri, like some big puris, which I'm gonna pop right now. Idli, vada, kesri bar, and khara bar. This is really good. Isn't it good? Wow. Mm. Whoa! Check it out! Oh wow, it's gonna be so good. 
Oh wow. Mm. It almost feels just like a tomato donut. That's what it is right now. It, it kind of is. Mm. What a combination. This, so coconut, spicy coconut, and then samba. Whoa. Explosion of flavor. Oh, and this dosa. Mmm, so savory. Look at, these, look at how red this is. Like, you can tell this is super hot. It's so red. Spicy. Spicy. Ugh. It just cleared my sinuses. <coughs> oh, we forgot the chicken chili right here. Chicken chili. That's gonna be super hot. Super hot? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Okay. Is that really? This is hotter. On a banana leaf, we have basically it's like a southern Indian tali. Nagajuna? Yeah. So it's spicy, right? It's super spicy. Mmm. It's like a grilled chicken. Wow, look at that. Remember, these three fingers have it, right? And then you go. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. It's quite sweet, actually. Mm -hmm. A very light rice pudding. Like, very light. Yeah, super light. Yeah. Here we have the chic samba roll. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. The spices. Mm. I gotta say, whoa, spicy. It's got some kick to it, huh? Mm. With the butter chicken without anything, without any rice. Mm. So creamy. Mm. Very fatty. The grilled chicken, and it has like a little red sauce. Oh, spicy. Mm. Spicy, huh? Very juicy. Man, this is delicious. Like, this is awesome. Mm. Here we have masami juice, which is sweet lime. Oh, that's refreshing. Oh, it's delicious. Oh, wow, this is incredible. It's stuffed. It's jacked. Is that a coleslaw mixed with chicken? Mmm, so hot. Has a tangy flavor, a lot of sugar. So here we have the death by chocolate. Look at this decadent dessert. It's delicious. I like the combination with the honey. Yeah. That's what I taste the most of right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. I love the chocolate cake. So right here we have a tate idli. It's a huge idli. Oh, I just love this coconut chutney. Should I put it in the other one as well? Mix it. Oh wow. I've never had floating pani puri. Cheers. It's like a delicious puri with a soup. Sugarcane juice, but mine is infused with ginger. Oh wow. Wow, bro. This is so good. Refreshing. Fire pan, fire pan, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. Smoking? Oh, oh, oh. So here we have the potato twisters. Oh, wow. I love how thin it is. Look at that. It's extremely crunchy. Mm. <laughs> Dragon breath challenge. Oh, that's good stuff. What do you think? What do you think? Oh. <laughs> Chili corn, huh? Chili corn, yeah. Doesn't look like there's any chilies in here. I mean, it's not so spicy, there's like a little kick, yeah. like a tiny kick. Here we have some sweet roti, and it looks like there's a bunch of ghee on top. Oh, it's amazing, super sweet. Wow, the big fairy dice put on the side. And the way to do it is you always use your hands, right? Grab some of that. Oh, wow. That's spicy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, right here we have beef liver. Look at that. Wow. Like butter. So, this is beef kima. It's like minced meat. Oh. Mm. But everything is very spicy. Try the beef brain. Beef brain 
things right here, guys. <laughs> Has a very gelatin like uh, texture to it. Mm, it's very nice. Like, like jelly, just jelly. So this is beef cutlet. Wow. It's like a beef patty. This place is out of control. Beef fire. Here's basically a beef leg. As you can see, that's all fat. It's fat. Whoa. Oh, yeah. It's like gelatin, but a little tough to bite it through. Oh my god, it's tough. Okay, beef fry. Oh wow. Oh, not too hot. Got some biryani right here. That's so good. We're having some bread halwa. Mm. Super sweet. I love this thing. Mm. You want the Bangalore one or Chennai one? You want the Chennai one? Start with Chennai. The Star with Chennai. Yeah. Oh, mm. No spicy. So kitchen. Hmm. Sabadana pongal. Sabadana pongal. The jelly balls like thing is called in Tamil, they are called as javars. It actually feels a little sweeter. Okay, so this is samba vada, so the same thing, the vada, but it's been in samba for a long time, so it's basically absorbed the samba. Mmm, amazing. Mmm, a little sweet. Okay, so right here we have red rice dosa. Mmm. Dosa has a completely different taste. Yeah. Wow. This is the special butter dough sub. Mm. It's like an excess of butter. It's like they drench this thing in butter. It's a water dough sub, so it's, it actually looks more like a sponge. Straight. Oh wow. Mm. That is amazing. Masalvada. So masalvada is this. Oh, big chunk there. Really thick, crunchy. Mmm. This is basically a vegetarian's dream right here. Oh, nice. And the last thing we have is the coffee. And this is filter coffee, so the way it works is like this. I'm gonna try to do it without looking, right? <laughs> that's a good job? Did I spill anything? No, Perfect. Actually, that's pretty good. Mmm, milky, a lot of coffee, a lot of sugar. I love it. Cheers. This one is what? Andrach. Andrach. Cheers. Mm. Oh wow. Spicy, right? A little spicy. The Zandra. The Zandra? Yeah. Right there. Super crispy on the outside. Very juicy on the inside. Mm. This one is Maharani. Maharani. Yeah. Okay. I like it. Next to it Roger. is. Cheers, my friend. Look at the green here. Green egg. Oh, way better. Mmm. Pepper chicken. I love this. We have to go eat forever. Here we have ramba chicken. A lot of chilies. Mmm. Okay. This looks like a lollipop, right? Yeah. Chicken lollipop? Drumstick. That is a lollipop, yeah. I love this. Mmm. It is so good. So what I have here is I have a fish, I have shrimp with gravy, and I have rice. These fish have bones, as you can see. Mmm, love the fish. Has like a little curry on top. Mmm, not too spicy at all. Wow, tiny bronze, super yummy sauce with the curry. This is like fried squid with curries, onions. This is my first time trying Indian seafood, I'll tell you. It's up there with the top seafood I've ever had in my life. And right here we have a big piece, this is called the leche. Oh my god. Whoa. So refreshing. It has like a spongy consistency. So here we have the famous mud coffee. Oh, it's amazing. It's almost like a chocolate milk. 
Oh wow. That's sweet. Yeah, I want to start with one of these little prawns right here. Oh yeah. Mmm. Oh, the spices. Chicken leg right here. Yeah. Oh my god, look at this guy. So tender. A little juicy. Mmm, a little bit of fat too. Oh, and the masala as well. Mud and fried brain. Another super exotic <laughs> food here in Chennai. This is the best dish in Chennai. <laughs> best dish. Mud and intestines. Mud and intestines. <laughs> mm. Give me more. <laughs> Egg with mud and gravy, it's yeah. pretty big. You said gold. Go. One big gold. Look at this, how big. What? <laughs> One gold? <laughs> I think you were lying. You're bringing a trick on me. Squid fried? Yeah. Okay. Mmm. 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 Nice and crispy. Mmm. Mm. Okay, so the chest this is the roast one and this is the gravy. Yeah. Dude. Good? This is like, oh, it's so good. So fatty. Mmm. Okay, so here we have mud and balls. Good. Mm. Too good. <laughs> Definitely fried. Yeah. So it's a small fish yeah. fried. You can actually uh, the, uh, you can, uh, eat with the bowl. No problem. Mmm. I like that. Mmm. Yeah, you basically eat the spine and everything. Mutton nulli. Mutton nulli. So much meat. There's chicken uh, salna. Salna barota. Mm. Mm. Wow. Whatever this gravy is, it has been absorbed into the balada. Yeah. And the chicken just gives it an awesome extra kick to it because it's also really spicy. Yeah. Nice and tender. Mm. Yeah, this is called mutton chukka. Mutton chukka. Mutton chukka. No, this is not liver, this is like meat. Mutton meat. Yeah, so basically very buttery. Mm. Kolkata paratha. Mm. Basically, it tastes like turkey stuffing on Thanksgiving. Cauliflower fried. Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. Mud and dosa here. Uh -huh. Okay. This is strange to say. This is, almost tastes like a crab cake. A really, really big crab cake. Look at this crab cake. <laughs> Mud and cake. Chicken kappa. I need my hands for this one, right? Crab time. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Noodle taco right here. And on cake? Yeah. So this basically tastes like the inside of the coconut. Luchi gugni. And basically here in Kolkata, this, which is a puri, is called a luchi. It's so good. Uh, this is roti and this is dhoka dalna. <laughs> mm. It's like a, a lentil stick, yeah. basically. <laughs> mm. Egg toast. Mmm, a little spicy. Oh, dude, this is my type of breakfast right here. Here we have a classic samosa, stuffed with peas. Mmm, this is the best samosa I ever had. Banana flour chopped, this is awesome. Oh, mmm, lots of flavor. It feels almost like minced meat, but it's not. Bengali take on fish and chips. It's called fish fry, jumbo fish fry. Mm. Oh wow. Oh, the mustard spicy. Stomach portion of a fish called chitol with, with the spice. You know? That's the essence of Bengali food. Mm. So they're very, very famous. I love the stomach. Yes. Mm. Ilish, which is hilsa. Again, mm. it is a very, very famous fish here. Mmm. Real salty. Mmm. Not too spicy. Not too spicy. Wow. Big fried devil egg. 
Mmm, the textures are crazy. <laughs> oh. The name of the sweet is Rasagulla. Super decadent, super sweet, lots of sugar. Mmm. Oh my god. Super thick bun, very fluffy. Mmm. Spicy sauce. And inside, look at that. This is chicken fried momos. Super deep fried. Mmm. It's a pork spring roll. Oh wow. Nice minced pork in there. Mmm, super soft, you can see. Fish, ball, meatball, soup, we got a combination. You can either get it with fish or with meat, or you do both. Mmm, nice chunk of fish. I have no idea what the fish that is. It's a little salty. It's also a lot of flavor in there. Mmm, with the broth here. Oh yeah, so we're starting off with fish kebabs. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> Just like you said, it melts in your mouth. <laughs> oh my god, my mouth is like watering from how delicious that is. The mutton uh, with the spices and it's roasted in coal. And the smoky flavor we will oh get from the coal. Hands down, the best kebab I ever had in my life. Okay. So, chicken with cheese, this is their signature kebab. Mm. That cold taste to it. Mm. And the cheese around it. Wow. It melts in your mouth. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so here we have it the original casserole from Nizam's. Oh. Wow. King Kachori from this spot. Mm. Oh, what a different taste. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nice and crispy, it's actually like hollow inside. Singhara? Singhara. Samosa's cousin. Samosa's cousin. Mmm. <laughs> Has a little kick to it. The next dish we have is Kuri Kachori, which is basically curry kachori. Right there. Mmm. I mean, super savory. <clears throat> Spicy. Spicy. <laughs> So here we have the last thing we're eating on this food tour. It's called Chana Toast. Mmm. Oh wow. It's almost like a grilled cheese, but with fluffy cottage cheese. Mmm. And the, the spice is there. I like how the onions are really crispy. Oh, this is amazing. Pomegranate Lassie. Oh wow. It's not so thick. Nice and yogurty. Mmm. It's a, it feels like it's in between a lassi and a juice. Baby goat. It's been cooking in its own juices on a slab of coal. That is so freaking amazing. But locally known as Puchka. 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 One bite or go home. <laughs> More an explosion. Fried prawn. Mm. So delicious, dude. <laughs> no, my God. Ruti gugni. Mmm. Wow. Lots of sugar. Mmm. Love the bread. He toasts it like perfectly. It's really soft in the middle. Our next street food dish is Kokoda style Chinese noodles. Mm. Oh wow. Nice thin noodles. Oh, lots of flavor. Some vegetables, some onions. Mmm. Not so spicy. Mmm. Alright, so here we have Malai toast. Basically, it's cream um, from milk. It's a little sweet. It is sweet? It's a little sweet because there's sugar on it too. Mm. Wow. Okay, so right here we have dal chili. Dream hot. This is going to be the spiciest dish tonight. Mm. Is it? Oh, man. You have this little 
biscuit airy type of uh, dough that's fried. Mmm, the mint chutney. Oh man, very refreshing, delicious. But the best part are the peppers. They really are like something special to have for breakfast. You're a brave man. You're they're, a brave they're man. They're not hot. They're not hot. We have papra here. Papra. Mmm. Yes. Mm, nice and crunchy. Mmm. I'm getting a bit airy. Next up, we have Lilva Cachori. Yes, Lilva Cachori. Lilva Cachori. Mmm. Too much. Too much. Too much. Mm. Original dog like comment. Yeah. Mm. yeah. It almost tastes like a sponge. Very airy. Lots of little pockets of air. Mm. Uh, we have two types of bun. Uh, one is muska bun and one is jam muska bun. I'm gonna have some. Oh wow. Wow, the amount of butter there is great. <laughs> <laughs> it's too, it's too I'm gonna dip it, I'm gonna dip it. I need to. Mm, nice and sweet. I don't even know what that is. Is that cherry or strawberry? Mixed fruit. It's mixed fruit. Okay, yeah. I, I really couldn't tell. Wow, the flavor here is great. Okay, so we're ready to try six different Gujarati sweets. I'm super excited. A bite. Uh, it's of, you know, it's made of ghee. Mm, super rich in sugar. Lots of ghee. Mmm. Mm. And we have gotas. Gotas are basically fenugreek leaves fritters. A big one. <laughs> Vegetable fritter. Mmm. Mmm. I love the crunch. Deep fried. Uh, the, spoon, uh, the soup is of bottle gourd and spinach. Oh, it's pretty awesome. Nice way to start the day. Uh, we have Indian gooseberry and aloe vera juice. The lemonade or lemonade? But lemonade, it's little, lemonade. It's yeah. Just lemonade though, it's not a lemonade, it's more lime. Okay, so we are go with bitter melon juice. Reduces your bad cholesterol, improves your immunity. Good Whoa! <laughs> That's intense. Bottoms up? Yeah, bottoms up, bottoms man. Up, poha. So you, have, you must have tasted it in Maharashtra. I don't know, poha. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice. Mmm, nice it's crunch. healthy too. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, we call it key too. It's just incredible. Here we go. Oh nice, not my favorite. <laughs> it's like a super thin polenta, super thick, masala on top, some oil. This looks amazing. <laughs> it looks like a vegetarian... Pancake? Pancake, there you go, exactly. And they cut it into like little slices of pizza. Mmm. Mmm. Hot. Mmm. A little spicy as well. Whoa. A lot of heat here. Oh, the belly. Doubly. Yeah. Mmm. Oh. It's nutty, it's sweet. Mmm. I love the bun. Oh my god. Jumbo shots, which are basically plum shots. Very cool. It's like a super thick, plummy taste. Oh, this is amazing. Mm. All right, so we're gonna have some paneer tikka with cheese from Eat and Meat, a barbecue joint. I'm oh, sorry, this is so good. Paneer manchuri yes. with chilies. All the flavors. Some cheese corn rolls. Oh my god. It almost tastes like bechamel. Mmm. Cheese is melted. It's very spicy. Okay, and it's basically toasted. So, India, they have toast uh, toasters okay. for sandwiches. Yeah. Oh wow. I hope it's spicy. No, it's spicy. Definitely. Freaking. Okay. <laughs> Oh man. Live ice cream. Live ice cream, guys. This is the most insane thing in the world. Super cold. 
Oh my god, he's loving it. Brain, <laughs> brain freeze. Exactly. Oh. It's, like, it's like you don't know what this is. Exactly. They're like the realest ice cream in the world. Yeah. Uh, this is Gugra sandwich. Gugra sandwich. Yeah. So basically, Gugra is a uh, Gujarati snack. Oh my god. So buttery, crunchy. It really feels like it was a big piece of melted cheese just bursted out of there. Okay, so here we have a chocolate sandwich. This is crazy. It's chocolate with cheese. Yes. If you love chocolate, you love cheese. It's for you. Yeah. Oh man. Good. <laughs> oh my god. What a combo. Pao bhaji. Pao bhaji. With some chutney. With some chutney. Turmeric chutney or tomato chutney? No, garlic chutney. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's intense garlic. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. The thing I can tell you is that because of the cheese, because of all the ingredients inside, it's uh, it's a little more moist. It's not uh, you know as crispy as the doses that you have in the south. Oh wow. Oh wow. Strong and tangy. Mm, super strong and tangy. It is delicious. It really tastes like a pizza dosa. It has a lot of different flavors inside. You see the cheese. Oh, you see the onions. Too hot. Gotala dosa. Gotala dosa. Go what, what does that mean? Um, it's made up of cheese, paneer, and lots of vegetables. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like the, the cheesiest thing I ever had in my life. <laughs> Oh, but it's still good. Bro, oh, I know I'm full, but damn. The yeah. ice cream sandwich with cheese. Whoa, whoa, dude. Oh, whoa. 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 What a combination. Ice cream with cheese. Mm. And pineapple. Oh, but it's so good. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Spoken! <laughs> Spoke dragon! Whoa! It's too much. This is chicken pesto. It's boneless. Wheat, a patri. This is too oily. Mm. This is mutton cha. Mud and chuck. Yeah. Wow. Spraying off the mud in there. Oh. Chicken masala, chicken kurma. Mmm. Chicken kurma. Oh, the mud is super tender. I love the spices. It's a very rich sauce. We have chicken, uh, mutton masala. Mutton masala. <laughs> Girl, you know when you eat goat? You have to go through the bone. Uh, you have chicken fry here. You have marinated chicken in. Mmm. Mmm. That's too good. And then this one's prawns. Yeah. With chilies. Exactly. You have prawns masala. Oh. I didn't know prawns can taste so amazing. Okay, so this is mutton. Well, okay. But uh, you only have the leg. Yeah, you can. Okay. So mutton leg is basically just fat shoves in. And here. Yes. Bone marrow. Mm. This is like made for kings. Oh, just suck the life out of it. <laughs> We have chicken, uh, white, uh, it's cooked in white gravy. White gravy chicken? Mmm. Yes. Oh, very tender. Very light sauce. If you're not into spices, that would be for you. Okay, this is chicken tandoori. That's the best. Yes, it's dipped in curd. Mmm. Oh. So roasted, a little burnt. Oh, this is so good. And you see all the chicken there? Oh my god, so fresh. Chicken Hyderabadi. Chicken Hyderabadi, so it's yeah. Hyderabadi chicken, right? Yeah. Yes. Good. <laughs> so having green chili is not so spicy. Mm. 
Okay, spin it throughout. And actually intensifies a little later. Palm rotis. It's a rotla. A rotla? Yes, lasagna pataka. Lasagna pataka? Yeah, lasagna, yeah, with everything. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, super soft potatoes. Mm. That's a saved tomato ki sabzi. Yeah, I was gonna say it looks very chatty. Mm hmm. That was good. Oh, it's like a more like a moist chop. This is a patra. A patra. Yes. Do I start with this? Yes. Mm. Uh, you can say. Um, it's like a vegetable yes. roll. Yes, it's a vegetable roll. Mm. Mm. Tangy texture. Super tangy. Mmm. Great appetizer. Yes. Biscuit pizza. We all have tasted the normal pizza. Okay. This is a uh, biscuit pizza. It's basically made from refined flour. Wow. It tastes like a pizza, but with a crust of a biscuit. Exactly. Kakra. And there's like hundreds of different flavors here of kakra as you've seen behind me. I mean, it's just like it piles up plain. Hmm. Alone. Not so awesome. I've had Southern Tali. I've had Pune Tali. I've had Northern Tali. I've never had a Thai of this. This is just insane. In insane. It, yes. Yes. Mmm. It's amazing, but I think there's too much butter on this. <laughs> That's excellent. Mmm. You have coriander to it. You have tomatoes. I mean, I'm sorry. Everything. So many things that I've got. That was like now. Okay. Wow. Like a popper, you eat it. It's easy. Mm. Yeah, exactly. I've spent six weeks of my life in India this year. Uh, <laughs> rice? Mm. Good? Oh, yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs> I mean, this, this dal is nice, soupy, not spicy, good spices. Oh. The dal is basically a bit spicy with tangy. All right, here we go. The biggest tally in Mumbai. Look at this monster. So many different things to try. Bani Puri. Dark black doll, right? Oh yeah. Punjabi curry. Mm. Oh, it's amazing. If you're from the Western world, you eat this a lot. Mm. We saw them preparing them too. It's mm. incredible. Oh. In the back. The chicken tikka in there. Mm. Delicious. Oh. Mint chutney with fish. Mm. Oh, it's next level. Oh, love it, man. It's almost like minced meat, mutton, so we got goat, right? Oh, it's fantastic. There's too many things. I have no idea where to go next. Buttermilk. Okay. You know, I don't love buttermilk, but it's, it's really good to like calm down the, t the, the heat. Gulab jamun. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. It just absorbed all of that, and when I bit on it, it exploded in my mouth. Mmm, nice and gelatin-like, you know? <laughs> I love the rugby. Lamb for the win. If I have to like, if I have to get really poor right now, Mm. Mm. Insanely good.